Hi there everyone, this is Tracy from Lavinia Stamps. Thanks for joining me today for another demonstration. We're going to be using the 6 inch round gel press. I've got olive and I've got merlot. I think we need some yellow as well. So starting with the Sahara, I'm going to pop a little of that on the background first. And then using a smoothie, I'm just going to add olive. Just down at the bottom. And then some Merlot as well. So I've got the mica minerals, metallic bronze here, and I'm going to mix a little of this with some water. And then I've got my fan brush. So first of all, I'm going to add a few speckles of water. And then I'm going to pick up some of those lovely mica minerals and I'm going to just dot some of that over the top as well. So I've got Multiferous card here and I'm going to pop that over the top of that, smooth over, and then let's see what we've got. There we go. Okay, I hope you can see that lovely mica minerals. It's almost like gold leaf. It's um, really thick, it's coarse, so um, it acts differently to the powder, the mica minerals powder. It's more of a crystal. You can see it's a little bit coarser. So it really does make a difference using this one. Now we're going to stamp with some of our mushrooms. I'm going to stamp with the largest one first and I'm going to use Nocturne to ink up. So pop that round about there and give it a good press. And the next one, I'm going to ink this one up in twilight. So another good press down. I'm going to ground that down. So taking one of our masks and one of our brushes, I'm going to use the twilight to just go along the bottom like so 
and then add a little bit of colour over the top as well. I'm going to go back to the twilight and I'm going to add some smaller mushrooms. some foliage as well. I'm going to change colour now to warm breeze and we've got a lovely foliage stamp here so I'm going to stamp off. I just want this very to be in the background. stamp again in the warm breeze but I'm not going to stamp off this time. Okay so you can just see by building up those layers it just gives you a really nice depth to the card. I've got some watercolour paints here and all I'm going to do is just pick up a little bit of the red just to paint in the spots on the mushroom. So now I'm going to use some of the Posca pens, a few little dots, Lastly, I'm going to use some glitter. So using the glue pen, to do is just pick one of our glitters and I might go with the green and the gold so let's just sprinkle that over the top tap that off and there it is and you can see how that lovely green has stuck to where I've stamped it's a lovely fine uh, emerald green and I think it works really well. Well I hope you enjoyed today's demo guys and I hope it's inspired you to have a go yourselves. You take care and we'll see you real soon. Bye for now.